man, I am so pumped. I am so pumped. Let's wreck his face. Ba bam me We did it, guys. We did it. We are the champions of the world. Dude. You got owned, bro. You got owned. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. That's right, here on the Poopin' Evolved Extinction Core server, baby! So excited to be here doing flips, man oh man! Guys, thank you for coming and hanging out. As you always do, please remember, show that amazing support. Slam that thumbs up button. That's right, and if you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness man and speaking of awesomeness last episode we've been working on getting all of our dragon essence done up so we can summon in the tech dragon hopefully that gets to be done today we also went we bred our very first racks um alpha racks that's right our first alpha racks it should be all grown up now Oh, look at all of our beautiful, beautiful Rexes. We have our Mama Rex right there. Super sweet. We got to see the Hatchery, the Nanny, and uh, the Incubator, right? Incubator. Incubate. Super cool. And we also got a whole bunch of Alpha Dodo Rexes. Dodo Rexes. So very cool. Anyway, I'm just looking for a saddle right now for a new baby. We should have a new one on our tech guy because he's wearing the tech saddle. There's the daddy. Super awesome. And let's throw out baby. Come here, baby. It's so weird. It's got the female colors, but it is a male and an 898. So pretty decent and with the highest attack stat that we got. Oh man, look at that beauty. Look at that beauty. So very cool. So if you want to see it growing up, get laid, all that sorts of shenanigans, just go uh, hop back to last episode. Now today, very likely may be, it may be our last Extinction Core episode. I had asked in the comments of last episode for all you guys to help pick out, and you can still do this in the comments of this video. I'm gonna play in Ragnarok, on the Ragnarok rock map, and I'm choosing between another season of Extinction Core, or we could do Anunnaki Genesis, or we could do transformation. So any of these could be your choices of main core mods. Please let me know in the comments below. Anywho, let's head back to that little center island area. Let's see what we can find. We just need four more dragon kills, four more dragon essence. So let's see if that's gonna be a thing today. All right, guys, we have our first dragon of the day. First dragon of the day. Let's go take care of it. Come on, you can do this, bro. Bam! Come on. Holy crud, Nuggets. You can do it. Do your dive bomb. Oh, my goodness. I didn't even check what level it was. We gotta hope that it's not that high of a level. Yes! Yes, yes, yes. And we got the essence. So important, so important. All right, so what that leaves us, what? Three more to go? Just three more, baby. Just three more. We can do it. I know we can. Oh, heck yeah, look it, look it. We got another dragon, 200. All right, we got this, Griffin. We got this. It's so much fun trying to do this on the Griffin. Bam! All right, come on, come on. Get back up in the air. Get back up in the air, come on. Bam! All right, we got it, we got it. Come on, dive bomb. Yes! Oh, crap. All right, that time. Oh, wait, we didn't get the body. I definitely didn't get the essence. It should be inside the body. All right, all right, all right, come here. Let's go like this. Yes, got all the stuff. Beautiful, two more, baby, just two more. Two more dragons, another dragon. Seriously, bro, seriously, this is our lucky day. This is so good. Yes, and we rocked its face, and we got the essence. Dude, let me look at it. Three dragon essence. One more. Just one more dragon. Holy crap. Will you look at that? At last, the final dragon. Let's do this. Let's do this. Come on, dragon. Get your butt over here. Get your butt over here. Oh, my goodness. Look at it. It's almost done. It's almost a thing. Just come on up here. 
Follow me up here. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Our final dragon. All right, come on, come on. Holy crud, just come down here. All right, all right, I want to get you by the, by the ground, by the bottom. Come on, give it to me. Give me that essence, baby. Give me that essence. Holy crud. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Come on, you're super bloody, bro. I know you're gonna die. I know it's gonna be a thing. Give me your stuff. All right, almost done, almost done. Holy crud, I'm almost done for that matter. Holy crap, holy crap. Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, I could dive bomb it and kill it super quick, but I just don't want to take the risk, and we got it. The last final dragon essence. It's a beautiful thing, guys. A beautiful thing. Let's go head back and let's go craft our new tech dragon. I can't believe it. Finally. All right, guys, we are back at the base. I am so incredibly pumped for this. I can't believe our time is finally here. This is so crazy. We have the primordial tech, um, Megapithecus, Broodmother, and finally, it's time to do the dragon. The creme de la creme. I've only done this once before in a past season when it first came out but I think there might have been a few changes done to him. In any case, let's go to our super cool tech totem. Let's turn it on. Awesome. Let's first, we need to make this super cool matrix. It's one of every type of boss matrix. So super expensive. All right, crafting. Holy crud, that takes forever. Forever. We need that. We have 20 dragon essence, uh, 60 diamonds, six thousand black pearls three alpha dragon trophies you get one of those every time you beat the dragon boss um it's six thousand metal and three thousand element i mean come on now this is not cheap it's gonna be amazing and it is far more expensive than everything else than all the other tech guys so I, it better be worth it. This is all I have to say, but I, I know it is. I know it is. Also, other little neat changes. Look at this. The essence now stack. I noticed this in the last episode, but they, it used to never be a thing. Now it does. So much better. Of course, not for weight, but just for storage. All right, here we go. Here it is. Dragon. Why does that take so long to craft and the dragon is so quick? This I may never know. Let's turn off our tech totem. Oh man, are you guys ready? Are you ready, Griffin? Are you ready, everybody? Can we do this? Is it gonna be a thing? Let's go. Let's head out here into our little courtyard. All right, amazing. And, and, please don't glitch out like the, the brood mother did. Oh, bamby, we did it. We done did it, except, awesome, level 30, perfect. That's what they all uh, start off at. Can I can I ride you, bro? Is is that a thing? You're gonna let me move? Oh my goodness! It's it's wings and everything. Or oh no, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. All right, come here, bro. You unfollow. Look at this thing. It is gargantuan. It is beautiful. The most amazing tech dragon of all time. Look at those wings. They're just almost like lasers or like shadows or i don't even know how to describe it it is crazy town let's go ahead we can use our handy dandy little infinite grappling hook awesome and we are mounted ladies and gentlemen we are mounted look at this thing totally teched out look at you can see the teeth a little bit inside there inside that tech shell it is gorgeous I absolutely adore this thing. Look at it. It's almost got like double wings. So cool. And look at you can see my player like inside that little that little ring with spikes on it. That's so cool. So you're far more protected. Oh man, this thing is just awesome. All right, let's go land him again. Let's go land him down. Let's see what he looks like when he's landed. Look at that tail. It's got like a little yeah, it's got that super cool effect too, like the wings on it. it's the tip of his tail. Oh, I love it. It's almost like fire or I don't even know. All right, there it is landed. What a beauty, what a beauty. So we've got, oh man, it's just so cool. And it's a red, red dragon underneath black belly. Look at the hands, look at the toenails. 
The toenails, Ethan, are awesome. And the fingernails, the, the claws, I should say. Dude, it is just so cool. All right, let's look at the stats. Quickly, quickly. We are sitting pretty at a starting point of 2.2 .2 million health. Craziness. We are sitting at over 1,000 stamina. Very nice. 4,640 weight. Melee, 1150. Okay. These are not bad. And of course, notice there is no food. There's no oxygen. None of those stats that you can pump. All right. Very cool. Very cool. So you just don't even have to worry about this stuff. I'm going to put a bunch of Dino Aid X on it. And let's try this guy out. Let's try him out before, uh, before we put any levels into him. It literally probably doesn't even need a single level, but we'll just see. Holy crud, what all the bites do. So there's a skeletal dude. It might resist us a little bit, but 5,000 to boot. Holy Lord, that is so cool. Wow, 13,000. All right, so when it's not resisting or a mate boost, let's go find another dude. Let's go find another dude that we can chomp so that we can get the realistic bite force of the starting levels. All right. Oh, 13,800. Insane. By the way, you start off with all the levels. All of them. So that's the left click. The right click? What? It does like... I can't even tell what this is exactly. Wow! Do you see that? All right, we got to do that while we're in the air. We got to do that while we're in the air. Oh my goodness, it's like a crazy cannon blast, laser beam blast. I don't even know, but it's like an aura. Oh my goodness, that is ridiculous, and you can spam that for a long time. It does go through a decent amount of stamina, though, doing that, so do want to take note. Stamina may be a stat that we want to pump up just a tad. Oh my goodness, so cool. All right, so that is doing, let's go uh, head back down now. Let's also see if stamina regens while we're just standing still. All right, standing still, it is still going down and down and down. So it looks like we have to land. All right, good to know, good to know. Leave me alone, bros. Leave me Wow, and just look at everything that just dies in the area. It is crazy town. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. Wow. All right. So hopefully this guy isn't mate boosted. 1,380, it looks like, is the attack for that. Okay. Next, let's try C. Ooh. Do you see that? It does like a crazy wing flap, but then it shoots out like bombs. Oh, my goodness. Let's do this again. That is so crazy. Ooh, it's not shooting. Oh, the bombs are shooting that way. So that's directional. That is directional. I was in K mode. But bammy! Wow! Now, what happens if I'm in the air and press C? Okay, it doesn't do the wing flap, but it still shoots all those missiles. That is crazy town. Do you see this? Oh my goodness! Wow, that does so much. That is crazy cool. I dig that. All right, next up, X. What? Do you see this? Did, did you just see that? What in the crap? All right, X again. Dude, so it shoots out a huge, huge, like, missile thingamajig. I don't even know. That is craziness. Just bombs. That is nutballs. And, and, wow. So, 30,000? That is nuts that that's doing already. Let's try it over here on uh, this Alpha Stego. Bam! Oh my goodness, that did up to 69,000. That is crazy town. Bam! Oh, that is awesome. All right, so next move. Is there a Q? All right, that does a normal wing flap without any bombs or anything. Let's just try that over here. And that just, it, oh, it does do damage, but it seems like it pushed the, the larger dude maybe out of the way. No, it does both, but okay, very cool. Let's try the, 
Oh, what are other other buttons to do stuff? I'm trying to remember. Was it the O, the P? Whoa! That's kind of like its roar. I I would I would suspect. All right, bro, get out of here. Get out of here. All right, let's try that again. O. Oh my goodness, that is amazing. Crazy big roar, super cool. And then the final move I would assume is R. I assume this is the strongest attack of any of them. It'll probably have a charge up that we have to wait for. Oh, very, very cool. Very cool. And that would be pretty, pretty largely directional. So by the way, that that's Q. P, no, O is the roar. And then R is the super slam. And that's going to probably do the most damage of anything. So let's just try that out over here in the galley. Come here. Oh my goodness, 138,000. That's once again before I put levels into this dude. That is insane. Now can we go underwater without dismounting? Dude, we can. It does have an ox. No, I I have oxygen. But it looks like we can go underwater. Let's just try this again without dismounting. Yes, yes, we can. It kind of runs though, it changes modes and it's much slower. But that is super awesome. Oh my goodness. All right, I believe those are all the moves. Let's just check if any of those change while we're in the air. So we had that attack, that's the X. Does that huge missile ball, awesome. Q does nothing in the air. Oh, can it roar in the air? No, it doesn't roar in the air, and then the R. R does not seem to work in the air either, which is just fine. Dude, this thing is amazing. All right, let's 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 get it up to max attack now, guys. Max attack. I'm thinking a decent amount of stamina. Um, Speed seems fine. I don't think I need any more speed. We'll, we'll leave that up to debate, and then the rest will go into health. But, man, this thing is going to be a DD killer for sure. All right, let's do that R move. Bam! Nailed everything. Dude, this guy is just crazy town. Seriously, redunculous. Redunk. How, how you missed all those attacks, I don't know. But we got you. You're melted, bro. All right, guys, what a great moment, I have to say, seeing all three of the tech dinos that you can get so crazy. Absolutely love it. And you can just see how it dwarfs the other two in size. I mean, dragons are usually like that, but that is massive. And I'll tell you the truth, it, it looks pretty much identical in scale to a normal dragon. Just when I brought up another one. So very cool. I dig them, but I love those colors. Look at that chest. Such awesome, awesome colorations. You can see like the little spikes in the back of the head. You can see them there too, but it is all teched up. So very cool. All right, anywho, um, let's go hop back on and uh, let's put this dude, oh, oh, let's get out, of, are we in K mode? All right, out of K mode, beautiful. Let's go ahead, put the last five levels in one oh crap nugget did that actually work all right are, are we still in k mode all right out of k mode all right beautiful beautiful can we see the the things thing the jiggers all right 52 3 4 and 5 255 so we have 244 more levels to play around with however we choose so very cool. As I said, stamina is definitely going to be something that we need to improve. Holy crap. So hidden for 189,000 now with the left click. That is crazy town. Bikido hits not quite as much as that. Not quite as much. I know he's over 100, but not, not like crazy amount more. All right. Look at this. Bam. Just melts everybody. Everything. Kabammy! Oh man, I can't wait to take on some bigger, badder bosses with this guy. Oh man, it just melts and bam! Dude, this guy is awesome. All right, so we got the attack. Next, let's do the stamina. So stamina, what are the boosts gonna look like? Um, it's like a hundred. 
Oh man, it's going to waste a lot. A real lot. I'm thinking we need at least five. Let's try that out with at least five thousand stamina. And I that will probably be fine. We'll see when we take on some of the bigger bosses. And that's always the tough part with these dudes. Is how, you know, you, you end up sacrificing a little bit. Um, I do feel like it need it doesn't need a little bit of speed, but I feel like it could use it. It would it would be a little bit cooler. Man, this thing is just so awesome. I feel like cool factor would be improved. I know it's gonna be like one, isn't it? Oh, you jerk face psycho, why do you do that to us? Alright. And of course, because this guy needs both speed and stamina, we'll go to 130. We'll see how that feels for a little bit because I do got to work on that health a good amount. It's just the question of the stamina. How much more stamina are we going to need? And I'm having a feeling that 150 would be a little bit more preferable on speed. Let's see when we fly. Because that is a good bit faster. That definitely is a good bit faster. All right, come here, come here, trike. And, and... Bam! Oh my goodness, that does almost a million. 897,000. One of those might have been a million. We gotta find a bigger boss that has the health to really see what it's fully, fully doing. But not dismounting on it is awesome when you go in water. That is so huge. And that stamina is feeling pretty good now. Let's start to use some of the other attacking moves. Just, just to see how it feels. Just to see. I hope you're not a high level because that's an alpha one right there. Come on, are you are you gonna get annihilated? Yes, look at that. Destroyed. Oh, that was a 560. That would have been a good one. Oh wells, oh wells. Alright, alright. Doing awesome. Let's do some of the melting moves. Can I land right here? Ooh, he's having problems landing right here. Interesting. Let's go. Cause to do the big crazy attacks. Bam! Yeah, 1.8 million! Do you believe, can you believe that? Come on, come on, come on, charge up. It takes that long for it to recharge, but man, is it a killer, killer move. All right, I'm gonna try a whole bunch of spamming attacks. I just wanna see what the stamina's like. All right, spamming those. Yeah, that feels pretty good on the stamina now. I'll be honest with you. I think, I think we're all set. I think we are good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it just a little bit more time. I want to take on like a scion or something. Ooh, ba bammy and ba bammy annihilated. I'll tell you, some some of the attacks they're really not that large. Ooh, and it picks up the loot pretty well too, even with the the distance attacks when it gets the kills. I have to say that's pretty awesome. All right, so I'm thinking the stamina is probably fine. I kind of am feeling like I want a little bit more speed. Let's let's just try out this guy while I'm actually flying. Oh, look at those chops, dude. That's on a sign. That's nothing. That is nothing. It just rips through. Holy cow. Do I want more speed? Yeah, I'm going to go up. I'm going to do it. I know it's, oh, it's such a waste. But we're gonna do it. We're gonna go to 150. I, I want it. I want it a good speed. All right. I cannot sacrifice any more, and we are gonna go all the rest into health. Let's see where it ends up. All right, guys, and there you have it. Max level. I absolutely love this dude. We ended up with just shy of seven million health. Craziness. Five thousand stamina. We kept the weight the same. Forty six hundred. Man, 15,000%, almost 16,000% melee and 150% movement speed craziness. Craziness. And let's see this guy up against. Oh, we got Mega P. Mega P, get wrecked, bro. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Almost that 2 million. So crazy good. I love this guy. I love him. I adore him. So many awesome, awesome attacks. Get wrecked. Oh, man. Let's do this one. This one, I'm not. Oh, look at that. Almost a half a million. 
This craziness. All right, Wyvern, bro. Wyvern, bro. Oh, we got a deity of the winner. All right, where's he at? Where's he at? Oh, this is going to be the match that we've been waiting for. A deity. And speak of the devil, it spawned right in. That is crazy town. Oh, man. These are such awesome moves. And we can do them from a distance. It's crazy town. All right, let's 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 go find where this deity spawned in. Somewhere in the winter biome. I almost always find, if there's a deity, I almost always find them somewhere between here, just right around that green tower. Oh, there it is right there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Oh, are we ready for this? Are we ready for a deity fight? It's going to be awesome. Oh my goodness. Let's just clear out all the shenanigans. Let's try and get the trees away. I'm a little nervous that it's so close to our little uh, base area. That's a little nerve-wracking. But I think we should be fine. Who the crap's hitting me? Are you serious, bro? All right. Charge attack kills everything in the area. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. All right. Deity bro. Let's see. If we do the wing attack... Does that actually hit him? Does it actually do damage to him? Um, I can't tell. It's kind of seeming like it's going through him. I mean, that's that hit. It hit where he is. He don't even care, though, bro. Ooh, what did damage to me? What did damage to me? Dumb little woolly rhino. All right, let's try the X move. Oh, do you see that? Do you see all the things that it wrecked? That is awesome, but it's still not touching the deity. He just don't care. All right, um, laser? Do you care about the laser, bro? You don't care about the laser. All right, what about the normal wing attack? No, don't care, don't care. Are you serious, bro? You don't care about any of these attacks. He's just chilling there, he's not even moving. You're a normal deity, right? Yeah. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Oh man, I am so pumped. I am so pumped. Let's wreck his face. He's just sitting there like a dummy. All right, and... Oh! Ooh, that really didn't do that much. Holy crap! How did that not do very much to you? Oh, I gotta remember. I gotta do the chomp moves. I can't believe the charge attack didn't do more. Oh! Do you see that? That's crazy. All right, come on, come on, charge attack. Wow, dude, he resists the crap out of us. I kind of can't believe that. Our health, though, we are pretty much untouched. Our stamina, though, is what's becoming the issue. I knew it. I knew I should have done more stamina. I knew I should have done more stamina. Oh, my goodness. Once our stamina gets too high, it's... Oh, lordy, lord, lord, lordy. Once our stamina... Holy crap, that move, though. It only does, like, 7,000. I mean, we're resisting the weight him way more than he's resisting us. All right, how long does it take for my stamina to build back up? Well, let's just kind of check him out. Does your health recover quick too? You can see it's slowly going on. No, it's kind of not moving, kind of not moving. Yeah, that attack, what is up with that? Why is that not doing more? I don't know, but our stamina did regen back up. Oh my goodness. And what effects is he doing to us? So stamina drained and fatigued. What a jerk. What a jerk. Dude, I, I don't know. This is the first time I've taken on a deity since uh, Extinction Core had its update almost a month ago. But my goodness. You see, I remember Bakito just wiping the floor with this dude. All right, stamina's going down. I mean, I'm just staying landed. It seems like that's the smarter move. All right, he's about halfway down. All right, did I do the big charge attack? I think I did. All right, I mean, we got him no problem. I'm just worried about our stamina. I'm worried about it. It probably would have done better with like, come on, ba bam -y. It probably would have done a bit better if we had done like 10,000. I mean, that would have cost so much. We pretty much would have had to sacrifice our speed boosts. All right, Steven is back up, and he's not really regening his health that quickly. So that is just fine. We got this guy. Come on. You're, you're making this not exciting. It's not an exciting match. 
You're almost destroyed, bro. Just get wrecked. Get wrecked. All right. And, and, ba bam -y. We did it, guys. We did it. We are the champions of the world. Dude. You got owned, bro. You got owned. Gotta love it. Got to love it. ba bam -y. I love this dude. All right, so what do we get for drops from this dude? Um, it looks like the same old shenanigans. We got a bunch of new saddles, Alpha Wyvern saddle. Nice, nice, nice. Dire Bear, um, ooh, ooh, we got a new Mana Core saddle, and it's a Primal variant. Very nice. I dig this. I totally dig it. I totally dig it. And man, look at all that element. So very nice. And of course, the trophy gift and the artifact gift. Got to love it. Wow, all right, so that guy, it took a hot second. The deities are a lot tougher now. I do have to say, I do have to say. Anyway, um, yeah, let's let's carry on. Let's see what other shenanigans we can encounter to wreck with our dragon. All right, guys, over on Lava Island, and look at who else we got. Come here, bro, come here. Jump, 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 and get annihilated Ooh, that guy took quite a bit of hits i have to say that was a 500 something that was pretty crazy good pretty crazy good we got to kill all the bosses with this dude though we're probably not going to get lucky enough to see every single deity versus him but you got the general feel the general gist of things this guy's so cool how he kind of like shakes his little tail when he flies look at him look at him shake that tail it's almost like he's swimming all pulled in all of his arms and legs for the aerodynamics. It's super cool. Ooh, this should be kind of interesting. Look at this. Cerebrius. Come here, come here. Bam! Oh man, he didn't get melted by it. Oh, look at that one. Look at that one. All right, come here, bro. Come here. Get melted. Did we kill him? Oh yeah, we rocked his face. That's from the, the Monsters Arc mod. Just pretty cool. Oh, we got another dude over here. Come here, bro. Ready? Ready to get annihilated? Oh, man. Craziness. All right, carrying on. Can we find the chieftain? I want to kill me a chieftain. All right, guys. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Oh, man. I found the chieftain, dude. I found him. It's just right up here. Level 220, 320, something like that. Let's go ahead and rock all these dudes. Come on, guys. Get rocked. Oh, my goodness. Look at them all spawning in. All right, all right. We need to get up to them. Ooh, ooh. And charge move. Oh, my goodness. And he's defeated already. That is crazy, crazy good. Oh, my goodness. Looks like we got an alpha guy there. All right, come on. Charge move, charge move. Ba bammy and do the laser holy crud and yep we got all the amazing new stuff prime armor pack beautiful and we got a nice artifact sweet 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 all right moving along moving along oh we got a scion come here come here bro get annihilated get wrecked you just melt in my mouth yummy yummy and, oh my goodness, he goes to my butt. Why, what's up with my butt, bro? Get out of my butt. All right, this guy is just so awesome. And we're basically untouched with the health. Nobody is really putting a hurting on us. I have a feeling the, the lava um, deity would probably be a little problematic, but I'm not seeing one spawn in. So maybe for another time, maybe for another time. I'm going to take a quick little look over in the redwoods. See if we get any luck there. And uh, yeah, I'm digging this guy. It is just so incredibly awesome. All right, guys, I'm over in the Redwoods and the only half decent cool thing I can even find is a Titanosaur. So might as well, might as well. Bammy, dude, melted that Titanosaur. It is so crazy awesome. Oh, I dig this guy. Absolutely dig him. All right, gentlemen, ladies and gents, I do think it's time to head home. All right, guys, back at the base. Holy crud, what a day. What a day. What a season. 
this has got to be hands down probably my favorite season I've ever done of Ark. Ever. Ever. It's been so much fun. Let's have a little nostalgic moment before we go. Don't you think, Trey and Lacey? Oh, all of our tribes and so many of you have been hanging out with me this entire time. Let's take a quick little nostalgic moment to go through everybody. Oh, man, we have our Pteranodon. We have our Alpha Therizinosaur. Our favorite little Anklo has been such a good little metal gatherer. Holy crud. Prime Lobo, remember him. Remember him. All of our tech dinos, so very cool. Of course, we had all the four world myth dudes this season, and they're out. Our dragon, all of our alphas, craziness. Our crazy, insane base that we had this season. Yeah, it's been pretty open. I like the open to the element bases, but so crazy good. Our insane breeding station, it's just been so much fun this season. Our Prime B, oh man, it's raining because it's so sad to go. I tell you, our Dodo Rexy army that helped us take on all the end bosses. Our Rhinos, our Spinos. Oh man, our Gigantopithecus. It's craziness. All of our insane apes that we've had this season. All the Megapithecus, the 600s, the Perfects, the insane attacks that we had on all of them. The awesome saddles that we had all this season. All of our Gigas. Look at the Gigas and our Titanosaur and our Dire Bear army. Oh my goodness, I'm all caught up. Come on, fall down, bro. Look at them all. Oh man, all of our Tech Gigas. They've been so very awesome this season. The Titanosaur that fell through the world. Remember that, guys? I wonder if it still does that. The Dire Bear army that helped us take on all the end bosses. Oh man, all right, next next part of our base. Let's go, let's go. I love this area of the center map. It is, it is hands down my favorite place to have a base. Oh man, all of our monsters arc dudes, our crazy mountain dragons, look at this dude. The awesome wyverns, the hydra. Dude, remember the hydra, remember when we got this dude? Look at him with the three heads. He's so crazy awesome. Look at this dude. I mean, really, no other seasons had these things. Fatty Boom Batty. Look at our crazy trolls. Our awesome little Bargeist or whatever's. Oh, our Chimera. Look at this dude. The lion head, the goat head, and the crazy snake tail. Look at all of our alpha tribesmen. So very cool. Oh, and our, our, um, our firebirds are now phoenix. Look at this. We didn't. I've been looking to see if we could tame one of these things, but we have Phoenix. Man, we never got to check these out. But yes, this is what replaces the Firebird now. So incredibly cool. Wow, it is so laggy over here, though. Our insane um Cyclops dudes. Oh, man, look at our little chicken thing. Look at all you peeps. I can't even put on the names right now, guys. It would probably crash me. It is so laggy in here. But all of you guys that have been hanging out and helping out with the season. Remember when we took the entire tribesman army? Man, that was so cool. And we took on all the end bosses. I love it. Our Treant. Remember our Treant? Oh, you're so very cool, Treant. And then, of course, all of our alpha wyverns. Awesome. Our Dota wyvern. We got that more recently. Our rock golems. More T-Rexes, Alpha T-Rexes, our Brood Mothers, Alpha Brontos, Alpha Dodic, Alpha Spiny Lizard, Thorny Dragons. Remember these dudes are awesome. Awesome. Helped out so much. Mammoth. Crazy cool. Other dragons are Magma and Snow Golems. Look at them. Oh man, it's going to be so sad to see you all go. Our Manicore. Oh, dude, you're the most awesome manacore ever. I do have to say, remember our giant squid? Oh, remember when we caught this guy? This guy was a perfect 600. He's so crazy good. All right, put your tentacles up in the air, bro. Put them up so everybody can see him. Look at that. Look at that. Our alpha plessy that's in here. Remember our megalodon too? Our megalodon's gone because we teleported onto the land with him and he died. Just so many good memories. I do have to say, guys, so many amazing times that I've had in this season. 
And I'll tell you, I really could go another 100 episodes with this thing, no problem. I never got even close to as far done with the base as I wanted to. Never got even close, but I have to say, this is the closest I've got to finish. Look at these walls. Look at how far they stretch. We used to have dinos all over the place in here. Let's go grab our griffin. Oh, our, our crazy alpha griffin. I loved this griffin. It, I didn't love it at first, but after the update, when it got improved, it's so much better. Look at this base. Look at how crazy good it is. Look at our little metal area. Look at our walls. Look at how far they span. These are all tech walls. It's so expensive, completely enclosing this area. And we used to have all sorts of tech dinos completely toe to toe, hip to hip in here. My goodness, my goodness. I mean, look at it. It just goes on forever and opens up all the different parts of the base. It's been so much fun. And then, of course, the, the area that we have all of our tech all crammed into just this little tiny area. So nutballs, but I tell you, it has been a good time. A really good time. The amount of materials that we ended up with at the end of the season. I mean, look at this. Just artifact gifts upon gifts of trophy gifts and all sorts of insanity. I mean, it is completely nutballs the amount of stuff that we're ending off with. It's it's nuts, guys. It's nuts. I have multiple safes just jam-packed with all sorts of prime gear and alpha saddles. It's nutballs, guys. It is absolutely nutballs. It's been a blast, though. We will definitely do another season of Extinction Core in the future. I mean, it is my favorite mod pack. By far my favorite core mod. But we got to switch it up sometimes. So we will see. Maybe it will be next season. Maybe it will be in a few seasons. But based on what you guys say in the comments below of this video and last video will determine, will determine what we end up having for our next modded series. So very, very cool. I do plan to have at least another episode of Pugnacia as well, in case you're wondering. And I've also been asked um, the aberration we are going to be doing with the Pooping Evolved guys on a server. It's probably going to be purely vanilla. I don't know, maybe you'll have some mods in it. It will depend on what the rest of the guys want to do. So I can't answer that yet. Don't know even what mods are going to be working with that. It's a completely new map. All sorts of crazy new dinos, but we shall see. Anyway, guys, it has been an absolute pleasure hanging out with you all. Thank you so very much for the amazing support that you've given on this series. Please make sure to make it go out with a bang. Show that support, how much you liked it, by slamming that thumbs up button. That's right, if you're new to the channel, don't get depressed. This is the, the a brand new start coming on. And make sure to go back and check out the older episodes in this season. It has been so much fun and amazing. Extinction Core, you guys know, you guys know. Anyway, until next time, guys. I'm just, I'm almost getting teary-eyed here. It's so emotional, so emotional, but it's been, it's been fun. Thanks for watching. As always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. And peace out.